Becoming a profitable trader is actually easier than you think and you don't need to spend money on courses or lose thousands trying to learn how to trade. All you need to do is focus on one simple strategy. The same exact strategy that took me from blowing accounts to making millions of dollars in the market. This easy strategy consists of three things and made me profitable by the time that I was 16 years old. And if you stick around until the end of the video, I'll be revealing my secret tool to get the best entries and exits so you can replicate this strategy at home. As you guys can see, the only thing on my chart is this blue line and it's called a key level. These lines on my chart are the entire basis of my trade idea and are crucial to my win rate. Key levels are simply areas on my chart that price reacts at repeatedly. This is a trade that I took a couple days ago where I literally made $11,944 in two minutes. I found this key level for my trade plan on the one hour time frame because every time price reacted there, it reacted significantly. These reactions basically mean that sellers are just sitting right there waiting. You can find these key levels on any single time frame, but the higher the time frame, the stronger the key level and the better the breakout. And I found that the one hour time frame works best with me and my strategy. What happens when the price passes these key levels is the stock sentiment flips. If we get above it, we're bullish. If we get below it, we're bearish. And when the sentiment flips, that's how we're able to catch these big moves in a short amount of time. However, I don't just buy it because it breaks my key level. I also have to make sure price action is looking good in our direction. Simply put, price action is the behavior of the price in that moment. How is price acting? By simply incorporating price action in your trading plan, you can increase your win rate significantly. And to dumb it down even further, you can use the shape of the candles to increase your probability. By just reading the shape of the candles, you could take your win rate from 30% all the way up to 60%. Now, reading price action does not have to be that hard. I'm gonna make it super simple for you guys. What I like to see intraday is a reaction at that area that I'm gonna take. For example, this 135 to the upside, we want it to react there intraday. We got the reaction there. Now, for me to take this, I want it to react there and then continue. Look how it reacted and then didn't continue. So we have to wait for it to come up again and break out of that 135, but we know if price stops there, then that's a level that we wanna to take to the upside. Now we have to make sure leading up to that price action is looking great. And in the third step, I'm gonna show you guys how to not get in on that candle because I know a lot of people would. We come down, pull back, bouncing off this area. Buyers are obviously here because of the wicks. The wicks is showing you every time sellers try to take control, buyers brought them right back up. Showing that there's still buyers in that area, bringing us right back up. Look how big this candle is compared to previously. Huge candle to the upside showing that there's more buyers there than relative price action. Then we're starting to slow down here, as you guys can see by the body of the candle. So we need some sort of pullback. We reacted at 135 and then we pulled back Still holding that area, it really doesn't know where it wants to go, but it is reacting in that 135. And then once I show you guys in step three, I'll be able to show you guys how to get the best entry with that secret tool that I talked about. But you guys can see the body of the candle is starting to come up. It closed the highest it was in this relative time period. Next thing you know, red, sellers tried, and then buyers brought right back up to green, and then boom, we got in right as we're hitting that high day, 135, boom. Now for our sell, as you guys can see, one, two, three, four, five. Usually after five candles in a row in one direction, you start to slow down, right? Because people need to start taking profits after a move in one direction like that. So once we got the break, I was already taking profits off. Then we see this wick right here starting to form. So buyers brought it up. Sellers are starting to take control a little bit to the upside right there. We got another move in our direction, a bigger wick this time. That's when I got fully out because right now we're reaching seven to eight candles in a row. It bound the pullback. That's why we got fully out right there. If you want to increase the strategy win rate from 60% to 90%, let me show you guys my secret tool that I've been talking about this entire video. And it's the time in sales. This will allow you to outpace every single trader that you encounter. This tool will literally tell you what's going to happen in the market before it happens. Time of sales is an indicator that shows me orders coming in real time, unlike those other lagging indicators. It even updates the stock's price faster than the stock updates on the chart. And this is how you use it to get the perfect entries and exits. The main purpose of the time of sales is to make sure the momentum is going to continue in that direction, or in other words, break out of my key level. Like I said before, 
This 135 key level is made up of a bunch of sellers. So what we need to see is a bunch of buying momentum come in on the time of sales for us to break this level and continue. Just like a dam, the dam holds back all the water, but guess what happens when the dam breaks? If there's enough water for that dam to break, it's not gonna break it and then stop right after. It's gonna flood. And that's how you guys see these crazy moves in literally one to two minutes, because I think of it just like a dam. Look what happens when we took this 135 to the upside. Look at what happens when we broke out of 135. As you guys can see, price is absolutely flying. You guys saw the time of sales start to go crazy once we broke out of that 135. That's the momentum we like to see. On top of that, it actually updates faster than the chart. As you guys can see, it says 135.12. We're still at 135 on the chart itself. Now, step one is to find the key levels in a one hour time frame. Step two is to actually make sure price action is looking good in that direction. And step three is identify the momentum on the time of sales. You will not find another channel on YouTube that will cover any part of this strategy anywhere else. So if you would like to learn more about the easiest strategy out there, please consider subscribing and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.